enemy suffers. The enemy. to the land of solo queue at the hill. Hey guys, welcome back to another solo queue video. As you've noticed from the intro, in this game our team don't pick tank, which is kinda normal in solo queue and enemy to great advantage of that in early. The, the enemy the is picking. And we got Aldous Hyper, which means no early game, plus we got Eudora, which is a good pick, but she needs a tank support or else enemy can easily target her, so I decided to play Esmeralda as a tank. It'll be hard match, yet entertaining, so make sure to watch a full video to know how to play in a situation like this. Esmeralda can't do anything before she hits level 2, so here you notice one thing that I'm going for XP lane. You must be thinking why, I told you I'll play her as tank, yes I'll play her as a tank but before that, I'll share a little experience from the XP laner so that I can hit level 2 quickly. But not to worry due to XP lane advantage both of you will hit level 2 at the same time, it will not affect the side laner's XP. After that, you can go for roam and continue your rotation. You can also try this on other tanks to hit level 2 quickly. Esmeralda got good mobility so I can usually rotate and invade enemy jungle. Enemy's tank is rotating bot lane which means Holly must be farming solo, it's a great opportunity to invade. Always remember, invading enemy's farm will help you in two ways. First, it'll delay enemy cores farm. As per new update, junglers can get that much gold or XP from the lanes. So it'll help you to suppress enemy farm drastically. Second, it'll draw enemies attention which will force them to rotate and help the enemy jungler. As you'll notice, enemy tank is now busy distracting me rather than ganking other lanes. Aldous is low enough. If I go away, they'll definitely pick him up, so I need to engage to save the core. I'm trying my best to buy some time for a jungler to get enough farm.
Over here, both Yajora and Ben Data are putting pressures on Chow. So try to backdoor him so that he can't escape. While I was doing my rotation, our team fed Harley a lot. Now he's dealing a tons of damage. I'm trying to distract the Simeon from the team fight so that he can't deal damage. If you notice carefully, Mash is taking Lord now. If we manage to take them out, we can easily turn the table. Now here I'll notice a drawback, I'm charging to aim and gauge that Aldo's busy getting stacks for the next game I guess. We could have easily picked both of them up without any casualties. Always remember whenever you are in the lead, try to maintain it by snowballing. Always run gauge from Aldous and die when Lord is up. But our master is focusing on Lord while enemies are busy. I'm trying my best to distract enemy hyper. Now the main target is the Sealant, he's the only one who will do most damage now. 